hitting like dudes like us, but I address it in the feelings got caught up. Just right away, but they got caught up. But there's more to it, I remember once. Saying less on the peons. Let's go to Vegas and watch Celine Dion. Make them say what we are. Hey my harmonies, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Symphony and in today's video, I'm going to be filming a vlog for you guys. I haven't done one since the springtime and now it's fall or it's about to be fall. I'm going to be doing a few errands today. I might go to Target, TJ Maxx. I just decided that I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. And this is how I did my makeup for today. It's pretty light. I didn't really do much but as you've seen, add concealer, powder, blush, you know, something really natural. If you guys want to know my lip combo, I did use my She Glam lip liner in the shade Toasted. I had only outlined this area. Then I used my lip glow oil. This was also from Shein. Everything that I had used will be listed. And actually, I'm going to put this in my purse. I just got done doing my TikTok, but I did change my necklace because the other one looked like it was going to break soon because of the clasp thing on it. So I decided just to put on my cross. I love this necklace so much. I'll insert the name right here to where I got it from. I didn't realize my face looked so oily. Oh my gosh. Or it's maybe the camera. Like, I mean, it looks glowy, but it's like... I'll probably show you guys my outfit, like, while I'm out and about because my room is a mess per usual and I need to hurry up and do what I need to do. I'm gonna put you guys right here because I need to pack some things in my bag. I haven't vlogged in so long. I feel like I'm really awkward right now and also I'm tired at the same time. But this is the bag that I'm gonna bring. I feel like it's a perfect summer to fall transition bag. And also has silver on it. It's like gold and silver. Mixed metals. You guys know how I feel about that. Like I'm kind of iffy but this bag is cute for it so why not and then i need to put all this makeup away i have this oil stain on here and it won't come off so i think i need to buy a new one of these bodysuits because it's bothering the heck out of me right now but i don't have time to like worry about that so i guess it's just like it is what it is type of situation with it but yeah let me hurry up i keep talking but not like getting anything done right now so i will talk to you guys whenever i am in tj maxx target or i might go to the dollar tree too i don't know whenever i'm in those stores okay okay first i'm going to sally's because my mom needs some new earrings and she likes going to Sally's to get them. But this sign right here is really good. Literally, right when I walked in, I seen this. And everyone has been looking for this one or this one. But I'm not into Hello Kitty like that, but this is really cute. I just found this juicy couture purse and this purse that reminds me of Hermes. Like they have so many cute different purses. They even have Aldo. And they have this bag. That really looks like Bottega. A lot of cute bags in here. And I think I've seen this one. Cute, cute, cute. And this is my outfit. I just have on these jeans from Shein. Shein necklace. This. Then they have like a bunch of cute vanity decor items and more vanity mirrors. I've been looking for this for the longest time, but they have it in the smaller version, which I think I'm going to get because I've been wanting to try this out again. And I remember using this the last time and it worked really good in my hair. Notice that they have a bunch of different press on nails, even Hello Kitty. So many different ones. Why do they have a Baccarat dupe in here? Is this a dupe? 
If this is a dupe, I'ma freaking get it because ain't no way. I'm currently smelling the heck out of these perfumes because I'm really hesitant of getting this because I already have something like this, but I think I wanna replace it, but I'll tell you guys why later. This one looks very interesting too. Like, oh my gosh, I wanna get all of these. I'm a perfume addict. Like at this point, I will admit that right now, I am a perfume fragrance addict. They have like a bunch of juicy couture ropes here. Like I'm so glad I came on this day. Like this is so nice, but I don't like wanna get any because I already have a juicy couture robe and I have too many ropes. Like that's the thing, literally. These are so aesthetically pleasing and it's only five dollars yeah these are really cute and then oh my gosh look at this cute little mug oh my gosh i'd be forgetting tj maxx be having one of the best cutest mugs and this one oh my gosh this one like this teacup looking one how much is this only five dollars and ooh, princesses oh my gosh these are so cute that one this one they have so many cute ones like i kind of want to get this right now i'm in the candle section and it always gets overwhelming for me every single time because they have so many what is this one this one just caught my eye what is this oh my gosh it looks like a whole dessert what the heck how much is it it's only 13 this looks very interesting very now how does it smell oh my gosh it smells like an actual dessert oh this is dangerous but it looks very yummy Fall. Now I need to take back some pads and a lip liner because apparently I got the wrong pads. So now we're at Target. They still don't have the one that I want. I'm so sad. Mm, nope. None. None of them at all. Wait, they have iced coffee. But I don't see them having the body wash wait is this it no this is not it i want the other one i needed some new razors but the thing is i don't know if i have extras of these but i think just in case i'm gonna grab these i think i want to try a new shaving cream because usually i use this one but it's $7.39, but the EOS ones are $4 for one. Or I should try the Aveeno shave gel, but I'm more of a cream person than a gel. So I don't know what I want to do right now. Kind of want to try this one. Wait, it says non-foaming. Mm, I kind of like it when it foams though. <laughs> section of target and i think i want to try some men's razors because i always heard about them working way better than women's and i just want to try it out for the one time and i got this brand but i'm not sure if i want to get gillette or this but like like what's the difference somebody like please i need help so bad like is this like how many okay it comes with five blades this comes with three blades. This one comes with five. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I am back from running errands and I am so tired. Like, I 
I could literally knock out right now. I had to go to TJ Maxx because I haven't went there in so long. And I'm honestly very happy with my purchases because I was planning not to get anything or maybe only get like one or two items. But you know, it's TJ Maxx. I'm going to end up getting more than one or two items. But I had got this macadamia natural oil deep repair mask. I remember TJ Maxx having this in a bigger size, but they only had this size available. Oh, this smells so good. Oh my gosh. No wonder why I love this. Besides it smelling good, I do remember this working great in my hair. It's a revitalizing hair reconstruction for dry, damaged hair. 3C, 4A type of hair. This was very random, but then again, I was kind of wanting this anyway because i already have this in a hollow kitty form but i'm not like a huge hollow kitty person like it really depends on my mood one minute i'm in a y2k mood other minute i'm in my aesthetics browns whites nudes kind of bland mood other moods like i just have so many different moods and i really think it depends on the season but for this season i'm kind of aiming aesthetics you know like the modern aesthetics but anyway i just wanted something plain and i had got this plush cosmetic headband this was only 3.99 so four dollars and with the hello kitty one that one is like white with ears and the little hello kitty bow but i needed something plain jane like this and a light pink color i love wearing these whenever i'm doing my skincare routine or doing some type of self-care spa routine so in my tj maxx i noticed that they updated the beauty area so there's more lighting like hitting that area and it's kind of reminding me of like marshall's sephora lashes and these lashes are so pretty like i don't know about the wispiness of them like are they like a little bit extra wispy or do they just look like that like from the box these look pretty good these look like they're gonna make my eyes look so pretty and i love this type of style to them these are in the style feisty and lastly i had got one candle i was this close of getting two candles but i was like wait a minute let me just let me just see how it goes because lately i've been trying to use up all my candles like right now i still have my summer candles out and i've been trying to light all of them up at least once or twice a day so i can just get them through the season and just get new ones when the season comes back around but i had got me a fall candle and this is from dw home it says simply fall dw home vanilla pumpkin scented candle and this was only eight dollars but i feel like this candle should have been at least you know like five dollars but you know inflation and on top of it it has a really cute pumpkin so that kind of inspired me just to get this one and it has like a really nice light scent to it this would be like the perfect everyday candle that could light up the last place that i went to was target and i needed to get some hygiene products and just restock on some certain products and try out some new products the first item that i had got that i really needed to restock up on is the cerave facial moisturizing lotion the ultra lightweight one and this is the pm version because i have the am version and i think that causes me some flashback whenever i have like makeup on and take pictures I kind of leave that one alone but with the pm version this works so good like as a nighttime moisturizer daytime moisturizer under makeup like it makes your skin look so good and i do have it on right now this moisturizes throughout the night and helps restore the protective skin barrier with ceramides and niacinamide and hyaluronic acid oil free it doesn't clog my pores it's just it's just a really good moisturizer and this is how it looks <gasps> I didn't realize i had got this i did not realize that i had got the small moisturizer this is the one that i usually get this is the difference you know what it's okay because i'm still gonna use this one i don't feel like taking it back like there's no like there's no point because i use it anyway and it's just you know whatever next i had got this brush and it's the annie's two-way brush perfect for all hair types 
and if this does not work for my hair i'm immediately taking this back because you guys know how i do my little slick backs and my like hairstyles like this um i'm tired of using a toothbrush unless it's like little what is it called like little touch-ups like for this or like little parts like that but with the toothbrush i do it everywhere and that takes a lot of my time so i was thinking using a brush like this like this side mostly or mainly this side mostly would like be a quicker process for me and i remember marie j talking about this type of brush in one of her vlogs and i think she said she already has this one and she wanted like a smaller one so i was like oh okay this would be perfect for traveling and you know it was just like a two-in-one thing for me next i had got some strengthening nail polish remover for natural nails and it has keratin in it this was like only two or three dollars get the bigger one because i'm always painting my toes with normal nail polish i do not like using gel on my toenails at all because the last time that i did i remember i made my big toenails feel and look so brittle when i had painted them with gel polish and use a uv light and all of that never again i am a firm believer of always using regular nail polish for toes especially if you have like really nice healthy long nails or like your nails could get long and like you don't need to use acrylic or fake nails or none of that if you already have like nice shaped looking toenails i had to get some more shaving cream because i didn't even realize that i had ran out like at the last minute like i had no idea this time i had got a different one so this is the eos shea better 24 hour moisturizer shave cream and this is the vanilla bliss i had tried this in a different scent like from many years ago or not even that long ago maybe it was like two or three years ago but i wanted to try this scent and i kind of forgot how this works i don't remember if i liked it or not but i really want to get like a vanilla scented shaving cream and this smells super well, let me be careful this smells super good and this upcoming winter fall like my skin is gonna be tripping with the dryness so i needed something that has like a lot of moisture i needed to get more mouthwash and this is the thera breath dentist formulated fresh breath oral rinse and i had got the flavor invigorating icy mint because i know they have like a different mint flavor but i really love the light blue one i love that feel in my mouth you know like i like that i haven't used a suave body wash in a really long time so i decided to try out this one and this is the cocoa butter and shea with sweet blend oil essence with a long lasting fragrance the scent in this is cocoa butter coconut and vanilla so i'm kind of going with like a little vanilla theme here and with the smell of this it just smells so good and it's not like too overwhelming then lastly i had got the maybelline hyper easy eyeliner and this is in the shade 810 pitch brown and yeah that is all that i got today i am so tired like you guys probably can already tell i will talk to you guys maybe tomorrow or the other day because i know i have like a lot to do tomorrow with like work and stuff and i feel like i'll be more available in the next day or two but i hope you guys have a really good night and a really good morning or whatever time you're watching this vlog and i'll see you guys in the next clip before i get ready for bed i want to show you guys my little setup that i have going on i don't know what i'm going to do with this yet maybe just put it away i do have the candle right here and then i had also got these at target like two weeks ago and these were only a dollar for the mini ones so i decided to get two of these and just put them right here and i feel like it kind of matches because i have these but yeah as of right now this is like my little fall section for like my videos and stuff i don't know what i'm gonna do with this yet either because i like this too this is what i have going on so far hey my harmonies i just got done doing a wig install for you guys and honestly it doesn't look too bad i brushed out the curls too much but you know what it's okay as long as i got the content done 
I'm good, I'm good. Now I have to clean up my room because I have so much that I need to put away. I have made a mess earlier because I was trying to find that one item. But that one item was right in my face. So I made a mess for no reason. Like it was honestly a low key stressful day for me, but you know what, it's okay. At least I got my work done. And that takes off a lot of pressure for me as long as I've got my work done and like do what I need to do in order for me to stay sane. I hope you guys are having a good day though. I hope you guys are having a blessed night, blessed evening. Let me know what you guys have going on right now or lately it's because I enjoy talking to you guys but sometimes I feel like I can get like really repetitive sometimes like I don't know maybe it's just me overthinking because I can't overthink because when I tell you guys thank you I'll be like thank you thank you like I say it like often but I genuinely thank you guys for like commenting and like saying compliments and just giving me your guys opinion like stuff like that like I genuinely appreciate that and I really appreciate when you guys talk to me too so I think I'm just overthinking I don't know I don't know actually I do know but I don't want to go on a rant yeah, this is filled up to the freaking top. So this one, oh shoot. This one is my favorite fall scent. Almond Blossom smells the bomb. Then we have, oh, I forgot about this one. Wait, I talked about it in a few clips. It smells super good. And I just did a Bath and Body Works haul too. So I think, see like, oh my gosh, I have so many videos. That i have to post but um yeah oh yeah this one this is a good everyday scent regardless of the season let me tell you guys about my nails oh my gosh these have been lasting me for the whole month one of them or two of them popped off but i glued them back on but it was on my right hand but these ones right here on my left hand like oh my gosh do you guys see my cuticles and like how outgrown my nails are these have been staying put because of the method that I do like my go-to must-have method like you guys have to watch that video but I just have so many different body um, care items and body sprays like this one was from 2013 or 2014 but this is like one of the best holiday scents or Christmas scents this one is in frosted snowberry and this one is in pink sugar plum literally one of the best scents and i really need to try out bath and body works holiday scents again i'm literally such a hoarder why do i have this still but it still works it smells great still so yeah i keep forgetting to use this and i still have this too like the girls that get it get it okay like i love scents that's just really it for real i just love smelling good bath and body works needs to stop playing and bring this scent back like there's so many scents that they need to bring back but i remember getting this while they were having their little semi-annual sale way back in the day and well not yeah it is way back in the day but <laughs> but this was my favorite and i've been hoarding this until like they bring this back out because this smells so good but this is what i have going on so far especially over here i've been emptying this out and i just have so many and now i'm just ready to switch them up for the fall and winter scents these are some of the scents that i have put to the side from my spring and summer scents because i think all of these right here are gonna be good for like all year round not just for spring and summer Okay, so I'm back on my phone because my SD card on my camera is full because I was filming all day. Like I literally filmed like three different videos and I feel very accomplished but then again I'm annoyed because I ran out of storage and I don't feel like getting my other SD card out. I'm just gonna finish the end of this video on my phone camera. I was planning to tell you guys about something that happened but oh my gosh my neck like i don't know what's going on i don't know if it's like me being a diabetic or i put something on my neck or it's the weather like i don't know my neck right here just specifically only this part has been feeling like i have eczema but i really think it's like my diabetes or something i have been moisturizing it and it's been helping a lot but i notice when i don't 
it will slowly go back to the way it was because it was looking way worse it was looking red and it was looking like ugh, super dry and itchy like the first red flag i noticed was like a few weeks ago like my neck was like being really itchy like right here i think i had sprayed a certain perfume i think i had sprayed one of those like really cheap perfumes like directly on my neck because i remember doing that and i think it triggered like something on my neck and i'll let you guys know right now actually i think i sprayed this one and i had got it off of timu i highly suggest using this only on clothes like if you want to wear this spray it directly on your clothes not on your skin because i had tested this out on my clothes and it didn't affect me at all but directly on my skin or on my neck or somewhere that's like really sensitive i think it triggered something but i'm still gonna test out timu's perfumes because they are pretty interesting when it comes to like stuff like that like off of timu or aliexpress just like websites like that it's like Mm, let me be careful because i don't know the ingredients i don't know nothing about it all i know is that the bottle literally looks like a dupe so yeah i just had to let you guys know i was planning to tell you guys like um in the last few clips but i kept forgetting i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and if you did let me know in the comments and like this video i'm looking super tired <laughs> I'm looking like super super tired but and if you guys want to see more videos like this a beauty fashion lifestyle content girly content any content that makes you feel feminine or extra feminine then you guys will love it over here i love you guys so much and god bless you all in jesus name and i'll see you guys in my next video